Hello, my friends. My name is Miss Ng from the Shaler North Coast Library. I have a pretty short book for this evening, but it's a really cool one. It might answer some questions about some things you've been seeing on the news or hearing about. And we've also talked about this before with people who've marched for different reasons. And like the Million Man March. Remember, remember we talked about Dr. Martin Luther King? And anyway, it's called Sometimes People March. It's an awesome book by Tessa Allen. And it's going to start off some other kinds of beings marching. Sometimes ants march. And sometimes bands march. And sometimes people march. Marching is something people do together when they want to resist injustice or when they notice something needs changed. People march for many reasons. People march for things they care about and people they love. People march for the health of their bodies and their communities and the world. People march for the freedom to love and live and learn. Sometimes people carry signs to share their stories of resistance. All kinds of important signs there. People resist in many ways. Sometimes people resist with their voices. They might resist with words or with song or art. People resist with meetings. They resist by standing up or sitting down or taking a knee. It isn't always easy Feet get tired, arms get tired, hearts and hopes get tired. Sometimes problems seem too big or complex. But we do, mar we do not march alone. Ants are stronger together and bands are louder together. And people are more powerful together. Sometimes from feelings of fear or anger or injustice comes hope for change. Sometimes when great change starts small with a brave question, maybe your question, a question that calls people together. And together, we find the courage to march. And that, my friends, is sometimes people march. Keep marching along in your beautiful way, my friends. Kiss your beautiful brain. Kiss your loving, beautiful hearts. And look in the mirror and say, hey, good luck. Because you're all